Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Like always, before we get into the story for today, we're going to be quickly looking at the coin market cap. So Bitcoin's been on a little bit of a tear since I've last recorded and we're at almost 54k, up almost 8% in the last 24 hours. Um, same with Ethereum, uh, up almost 6%. Uh, we've got Binance coin up 15% and we're starting to see greens over the board. Uh, we're seeing a big reversal in the trend. But yeah, let's look at the story for today. We've got Mark Cuban sees $1 written in Doge's tea leaves. If we sell another 6 billion Doge worth of Mavs merch, Dogecoin will definitely hit $1, said them Dallas Mavericks owner. After only three days accepting Dogecoin as a form of payment, Dallas Mavericks owner Mark Cuban is predicting the price of the token will eventually hit $1. In a Saturday tweet, Cuban said customers had used more than 20,000 Dogecoin, roughly worth $1,000 at the time of the publication, in transactions for the Dallas Mavericks, claiming the franchise was now the largest Dogecoin merchant in the world. The billionaire predicted that if the basketball fans were to purchase 6,500,000 doge worth of Mavericks merchandise, the price of the token definitely would hit $1. So here we've got a tweet from Mark Cuban. He says, The Dallas Mavs have done more than 20,000 dogecoin in transactions, making us the largest dogecoin merchant in the world. We thank all of you and can only say that if we sell another 6,500,000 dogecoin worth of Mavs merch, dogecoin will definitely hit $1. The Mavericks were one of the first NBA franchises to recognize crypto as a form of payment for tickets and merchandise, having started accepting Bitcoin through wallet company BitPay two years ago. Mavericks fans can also pay for gear and souvenirs with Bitcoin Cash, USD Coin, Gemini Dollar, Paxa Standards and Binance USD. Despite being created as a joke, Doge has surged in the last few months as billionaires including Cuban and Tesla CEO Elon Musk have mentioned the token on social media. Musk's tweets have likely contributed to the price of the token rising from one cent in January to a new time high of almost eight cents. The Dallas Mavericks owner previously described Doge as an economics teaching tool, saying the token was the best entertainment bang for your buck available on the crypto market. Even the surge in Doge payments for the basketball franchise, Cuban said he was still having fun and hasn't changed his opinions about the token. So to me, it does sound like a lot of speculation coming from Mark Cuban, but what do I know? He is the billionaire and he is the guy who owns the Mavs. So let me know down below in the comments, what do you think? And like always, until tomorrow's video, thank you for watching.